<laughs> What's good, everybody? It's your boy Potty with Grandmaster Glass. Slow one today, out in the studio. Just wanted to make a video for you guys, just talking. Yeah, today I was reflecting on where I started when I first started blowing glass and what kind of like got me into glass and like where it like where it all started I guess because it used to be a very negative I used to have a very negative self-talk and I would have like I said just I'll just leave it at that very negative self-talk so when I would look at glass I'd be like I could never do something like that even before I started blowing glass then I started to have a better outlook a better attitude and I started thinking like I could do something like that like what if i blew glass what what would i create and the city i live in uh there was a glass artist there is a glass artist that goes by smo smo glass uh, i will link him down below and he used to make the sickest implosions i mean i know there's quite a few glass blowers in the fume heady implosion game but man i'm telling you he he had the best and it it's kind of where it started for me to inspire me to be like, man, those are cool. Could I make those? Could could, could I do that? Uh, what what would they look like if I made them? And not trying to copy him, but draw from inspiration from what he made. And yeah, and there's also another glass artist, uh, Sean Thomas Johnson, totally legendary with the dot stacking. And that's where that passion also originated. But truly... The implosions, that's that's where I started. And if you've been following me for long enough, you know that's that's definitely my thing. I enjoy them. And so when I'm going to get all of this finished uh, over you know the next half a day, hopefully by tonight, I'm gonna have it lit. That'll be a different video. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to start to lose my train of thought. I'm gonna start going with implosions and trying to do that marbles different things uh pendants that's just kind of where it all started for me and yeah i just wanted to make a quick video for you guys talking just kind of just where i'm at today just wanted to check in with you guys i'm gonna get in more of a habit like i said doing this with you guys uh now that we've got the studio 2.0 dojo uh yeah we're just gonna start getting in this regular thing where i'm chatting it up with you guys whether it's a seriously good like content video where it helps you or just me straight chilling talking like this so uh yeah stay true to yourself definitely definitely don't don't doubt yourself believe in yourself uh there was this anime there is this anime that i love uh studio ghibli my uh my totoro no my bad uh i'm saying it all wrong uh kiki's delivery service i want to say my neighbor totoro kiki's delivery service and she has a quote believe in yourself and just keep smiling and I used to, I used to rock that shit so hard. And I just needed to remind myself kind of of that slogan, uh, along with my never stop evolving, just something really special and stuff like that. Just use it to your advantage. Use it to fuel you. Uh, and even if you do kind of stray, that's okay. That's what life's about, but the ups and the downs and never stopping. That's what, that's what's most important. So Hopefully you can get some inspiration if you're in a really, really low spot with whatever you're doing in life. You have the power to turn it around. I believe in you. Uh, believe in yourself. I believe in myself. And never stop evolving. So, till the next video, guys.